from a Oh man, I gotta take this shirt off. I gotta go, guys. I gotta take this shirt off. It's more like poop. Poop. Look. Right there. Right there. God dang it. And it's just nasty. It's a wet one, too. Good morning. Um, slept about a few hours. Uh, somebody's phone woke me up and it wasn't mine, but I'm not going to say whose name it was. Um, I got a gooey butter cake uh, sent out to Donna. Uh, I got Mary and Leslie's shirts uh, sent out. Uh, I was up till like 2, 2.30 in the morning uh, baking gooey butter cakes. Uh, because of the orders and uh, when you order shirts, hats, um, ooh, I don't even have hats, uh, shirts, aprons, uh, hoodies, and jackets, you get a free sample of gooey butter cake if you check the box. Um, got everything out the, um, the vehicle, um, so we got all that taken care of. I'm about to wash clothes later. This is my relaxation day, kinda, but I need to take care of the, the uh, chickens out here. Um, Tasha's coming to help me. And I'm going to pick green beans so we don't have big freaking cucumber sized green beans and they don't taste as good. So we're going to, I'm going to get those out. So uh, we have a surprise for Luna. I don't know if she, she's going to like it or not, but we're going to go inside and show you guys that uh, Tasha had bought her something to help out around the house. And uh, is there anything else you got to say? You get some sleep? Kind of? Did my phone wake you up? <laughs> I ain't mean to kick you. You kicked me first and then the phone. I, I, I told them I wasn't going to say whose phone woke me up, but it wasn't mine. So you kicked me to hurry up and answer the phone? Is that what it was? No. I remember the kick, but I was going to let that slide. Now I'm not. Because now I feel like, why did you kick me? And she did a bicycle possible. kick. She goes, do, 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 do. like a. Like, you know one of them sound things I put in? See, like, you lying. No, I felt that. Like, what? Okay. I hit you one time. Okay, well, let me uh, let me go see. We'll go check out Luna real quick. Uh, we saw her last night. Well, I guess early this morning. Oh, yeah, I got to show you this. Can you cut that light on for me? <laughs> Take that wooden thing off for me. The ones with the wigs are really getting, really getting mad scientists in um, 1980s rock looking ish. Like a, uh, who would that be? Who would that be? Where you go? In the corner. Style. Oh, there's one there. There's a good one there. The wig on this thing, shoddy. The shoddy wig. Yeah. Oh yeah, you got a voice, you got larnix on you. Okay, well I'm gonna clean this water out, fresh water, um, put food, in, more food in there, uh, clean this side out uh, so they can go over there and I, I need to clean all this bottom out. Um, you get Luna yet? No, she over there. Act like she don't care. This one. 
And we got a little spot down here where there's a hole. There's a hole inside the webbing. So she, there we go. Hey, Luna. Luna looks more um, groomed than the rest, don't she? She looks a little more, got herself together. Look at that, she's doing it now. I get to go inside and sleep tonight. Yes, I do. Come on, Luna. Okay. Okay. Well, we got to do some work, and I'll get back with you later on. Okay, guys? Oh, look at the mohawk on that one. Yeah. Oh, it's going to run. It's a runner. And the black one. There you go. Okay. Okay. Let me go before she poops on me. All right, we're in here. No big sticks uh, fell on this yet. I'm waiting to that to curse real loud in the morning when I see it. Yeah, it's sagging here. We're probably going to tighten it up. But here we go. Let's get in here. This is to keep the bears out. And me. Okay. Hey, look at y'all, biggies. Big chickens. Where's your friend at? Your friend all the way back there. You better get her. <clears throat> There's two yellow ones that stick together. The other ones are on top of that. Yeah, they're getting there. Okay, you get to come on out. They're up by that water, so they're they're they know how to use that water. It looks like. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yeah. Luna, you going What is that? Oh, it's an apple. Yeah, they ain't gonna like you getting down, Luna. They're gonna peck it. Okay. Okay. Well, Luna's gonna learn the hard way. It looks like she's gonna probably run back towards me once I start pecking on them on her okay well let me uh let me get this cleaned out uh we have all this food in here that uh i don't know how much is left oh yeah they've been uh, pecking at it but i think they've been pecking at the top to get it out so i'm gonna feed them more out there they're, they're not really understanding exactly how to do all this stuff so uh they still need to uh get inside get inside here what they're doing is pecking pecking this and having it come out so let me um, let me get them situated here, guys, and get this cleaned up, and uh, I'll see you in the garden. First thing I notice out here, guys, look at the corn, look at the corn, and look what that is. They call those tassels. Whoop, whoop, whoop. <laughs> Corn's got his little tassels. Look at that, two of them. Um, if you guys did not know, um, some of this might do three. Uh, but each stalk usually only does two ears of corn, of sweet corn. Um, they got them engineered where they might get three, but that's why they plant them so close together. Next year, we'll probably plant them closer together. Uh, we got the asparagus down here. This is okra right here. Um, we should start seeing little bitty pods of okra, which we are. Look at that. Little bitty okras. Um, Here's the asparagus. You just see the leafy bush. That's what she said. Right there. You can't really eat that for two to three years. Um, you got to keep letting it go. Um, Luna's down here to help out. And we got green beans. There you go. I was just taking a picture. Um, we did plant some um, green beans before uh, we left. These are the purple. Forgot the really technical name for them, but these are the purple green beans and green beans are like weeds they freaking almost grow it's easy to plant green beans uh tomato plants are all doing well they're actually doing a lot better than i thought i thought we wasn't going to get a good harvest we're starting to get little little blossoms on here tomato blossoms um, but we have them all the way down um, on two rows we got about a few of them staked up with the tomato cages the small tomato cages i'm about to buy a lot of bigger a lot of bigger uh, rolls, of uh, about 100 foot rolls, and I'll make my own out of four foot strips. I'll cut them, and it's time consuming, but they're they're a lot sturdier. Then I'll put staples on the bottom so they don't fall down. Um, these are green bell peppers, I think, or just bell peppers, or some kind of pepper. That might be a weed. I think it is. But there's two pepper plants there. Um, we got squash. Uh, we should be seeing almost start. So, oh, look at here. We got a squash on this one. 
a little bitty one. Look at that baby squash right there. So we got a blossom start to come. Oh, look at here. We got a nice little bitty miniature one there, Junior. Look at there. Oh, look at squash. We got a little squash on there. And then I planted some more stuff right here. This is a uh, micro greens, I think. So she's had some of that coming up and some spinach down here. So I planted more of that. Uh, down here on this row, I forgot what I planted, but I planted something else. I'm not really sure, maybe, maybe peppers. Uh, but I did Carolina Reaper peppers over here instead of all in the shade that's shaded over there. I know it wasn't the best idea, but I was just trying to get the deer out of here from coming in the yard. But I got Carolina Reapers. I put, uh, put them all in these mounds here. So that is the tour of the garden. Hopefully that I did not get you too dizzy. Um, she needs to probably water this. Um, we have a banana, banana tree right here. It was still looking pretty good. Um, the other one died. It was really, really small, that's what she said. But we have that banana tree there, so that's looking pretty good. Hey, look what we got here. Green beans. I'm going to have to pop a squat down here. This is mine. And this is Tasha's. Look at that. It's tall. Hers is taller. But we got a little bit of ochre coming up. I don't think it's big enough to pick, though. Uh, it's not big enough to pick right. Okay. I already said that before. She wasn't listening. Huh? I said it'll be big enough tomorrow. Tomorrow? Yeah. Ochre grows like crazy. You can't just let it go. Maybe in the middle of the day, you got to go check it again. Um, <clears throat> people that buy ochre from you, though, they always say, I want them little ochres like two inches. No. When you grow ochre, you know. They're just scared they get woodsy, like real hard. You got to have like six, about five inches or more for that, okay? That's what she said. But <clears throat> three to four inches, you don't have to worry about it. Maybe, I'm, I'm doing at least maybe five, five or so. Um, but people that buy them like, hey, I want them two each. No, no. Okay. All right. Well, Luna and, Luna and us are going in in a second. I did have to stop off at the brooder, give them some more water, clean uh, their pen, put them in the other, well, not their pen, but their box, put them in the other side of the box so I can air the other one out. Uh, put some fresh pine shavings in there with some, um, already said it, food and water. Okay. Okay. And after this, I think it's a relaxation day. I'm hopefully it is. Hopefully she don't work me too hard. I think I'm supposed to take some braids down. That's work. That is work. And I will show you the cucumbers real quick and then I'll head on there. But uh, there's no cucumbers yet, but there's <clears throat> there's a vine going all the way to the top of the, the deer fencing. We have about four or five of them doing this. There's some more down there, but this one here, looky there, got blossoms on it. But that one's growing really good. And so are these two. <clears throat> the other side, we had collards over there. Looks like some bugs ate that one. Um, I want to do organic, so I really need some hot peppers to, to ferment and some water and strain so I can use hot pepper to, to put on them. Um, there, are some, there are some stuff they make that's good for human and animal consumption. Uh, I got to see if it's really organic or not, uh, but we'll be fencing this in and definitely I don't want to put anything on it Even if it wasn't organic uh, If uh, the chickens were out here, uh, well, the loon out here helping us But we'll have this roped off deer fenced off so they can't get to this um, anyway But I'm more of an organic type of guy, so That's the battles you have um, with trying to do organic that you can't get the pests off, but at least the stuff that you do eat is not going to be freaking giving you three eyeballs. Babies. Okay, got to go. Go post stop recording. I know I keep saying I'm about to do something else, but I keep... Look at that squirrel! I keep on uh, finding stuff, but these are wild amazing blackberries they taste good there's no seeds in them and she's scared to she's scared to eat these beautiful things look at this look at this oh look at that 
Can I mix them in the bowl with the green beans? You're not gonna die, are you? Mm. Okay. Oh. Okay. In the front yard too. I don't know if you know that. Oh well, we need to get them. Don't pass them up. I saw them when I was cutting the grass. Okay. Well, I'm gonna get all these and then head on to fix the. Hey, you can feed these to the um, feed these to the chickens if you don't want to eat them. Okay. Go post. Stop recording. All right, we're here at the compost. Grab this for me. I'm, um, I put some of the, this is uh, the duke, the manure and stuff, and all this, this the, the bedding uh, that was in there, newspapers. Uh, try to get these out. They had little toys, little toys I gave them. So I want to get that out of there. Um, I need to put more water in here because what you want to do is get the heat going and, and start making it work by putting this back over it and getting the heat to get real hot like an oven and get all the bacteria and all the, the stuff to break down. <clears throat> um, we have leaves in here. Uh, we have, uh, we have uh, grass and straw. But all this stuff right here, like white, that's like bacteria stuff. It breaks... Uh, that's technical term of it, bacteria stuff. But I'm just gonna, you wanna, every once in a while, you just keep wanting to turn it. And when we cut the grass again, I'll put green in there and turn it again. Um, but what I'm gonna do now is get some water, pour a little bit of water on there, cover it back up, so it just starts the process over and over again. Are you gonna put dirt in there, like soil? Um, you don't have to put dirt in at all. Yeah. Not at all. You can put dirt in there to mix if you want, but all you're doing is making more work for yourself and making it heavier. And what people think this is, is dirt. It's not, it's just compost. It's just leaves, grass, and it breaks down and it looks like dirt. Like, you know, it gets the, the, that consistency. And if I'm wrong, I'm just gonna stick to my story and that's what we're gonna do. <clears throat> because we're gonna get people on here that are freaking rocket scientists that's gonna tell me exactly how to do it. <clears throat> but there's more, <clears throat> excuse me, there's more than one, <clears throat> one way to do compost, guys. Uh, but you don't want to use human feces. Sorry, I'm trying to stay in the view. Uh, the, uh, <laughs> you don't want to hu use human feces because people, well, unless, I guess, uh -uh. I'm not going to say it because vegetarians it might, it might work, but you don't want meat and stuff in there, you know, whatever. So no. don't try it, guys. Don't, don't even, just disregard I said that. Please. Okay. Well, let me get this done and we're going to get in the house. Last, uh, last thing I got to do. Get in the house and show Luna her little surprise she might not like. Go post stop recording. Trying to find you a spot to crawl in. Well, we are inside. Luna is a little tired, but look at what we have. It's a pamper your poultry. Luna got some panties. <laughs> <laughs> poultry panties. Um, and we're going to try to put this on as uh, this, this diagram shows it's so easy. The chicken is not even, isn't even flying away or, and it has a heart right there, look. So it was so easy. It should go like that. So we finna find out. So this part goes in front of, it goes like this. What'd you put in there, a pantyhose you said to make it like last a little longer? No. A a pad. Oh, that's the pad that goes in it. Oh, okay. I didn't know. No, that's not. Oh, that's it's a, a pad, a that's boat a plug. Always. Oh, yeah. a boat plug. Okay. I always sent it. Wings? No yeah, pun intended. With wings. <laughs> okay. Okay. Luna's Come just on, chilling Luna, today. Do, it, do you need my help or do you got this? Uh, we gonna see how she act. Okay. Because how do I... You gonna make a run for it? Cause it gotta go like this. It goes up under, right? I snap the bow on the straps and position the apron between the legs of the bird. Put your legs in here, Gary. Pull your panties up. 
Let this leg pull down. I, I'm trying to grab this leg. Okay. Wait a minute, Lola. Oh, it's not as easy as the pitcher. Okay. I'm going to have to I'm going to have to put this down and help her out and then I'll, I'll hopefully we'll Lola. show you the end result. Be right back. Call there. Go post stop recording. Yeah, she's going to sleep. She's bundled up. I don't think she can move too great. We'll have to see. Well, at least it's not hurting her. Like she got her little got little fancy fancy dress on. Like it's uh Rwanda. What's that? Queen tube. I can't even sing it. Tube. Right, how you do it? Let me make sure her little butthole in there. Okay, well, I don't know if we can show all that. Uh, but, uh, I might ain't going to look over there. But the, um, the pamper might work good. I don't know if she even wants to move with it, though. But she's sleepy, though. She okay, sleep. well, when she wakes up and prances around, we'll, we'll get her parading around here, poop, poop panties. Yeah, she's going to sleep. She's sleepy. Okay. Lona tired. All right, Lou's tired, and she does have a she little... Oh, oh, I didn't catch her falling over. Oh, yeah, she does not... Yeah. How is she going to sleep? It's throwing her all off balance. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, maybe put her in here or on the bed, and we will uh, we will get to you. Go to sleep, Lona. We will get to you later. There you go. Okay, good night, Lona. Tired. Go post stop recording. Hey, um, I just want to show you guys all the stuff that we got from the candy store in uh, Redmond's uh, candy store um, over there off of 44. We got a whole bunch of stuff here. Um, it goes from starting with pirate piss to radioactive stuff, enchilada, buffalo wing so black olives. soda, black olives, dirt soda, uh, dinosaur dung. Um, Martian poop. Martian poop, boysenberry pie, kitty piddle, and some others. You got to watch the videos for all those. We did get mustard, bacon, butter uh, as well. Uh, Randy had gave us these. We're going to try these out. Um, she got these uh, for Jazz, her daughter. Her daughter had sent the pineapple habanero, the applewood smoked cheddar, and the sweet, spicy, bar oh, sweet and spicy barbecue. So um, I did get the uh, Bob Ross for some reason. I'm not sure why. I, I just want to get Bob Ross stuff right now. But I do have some other stuff in the other room that that can go with. Uh, I'm going to go take a shower. And this is my day that I'm going to try to relax a little bit. So I'm going to take a shower. We're going to watch movies. Adding words and, and take her. Well, i got to take a shower. No. First you was like, it's going to be a relaxation day. And then he was like, you're going to try. And now you say, oh. gonna, you're relaxed a little bit. Oh, well, I'm going to relax today. Thank you. There you go. Well, after I take a shower and put the stuff up. Okay. All right. And uh, we'll talk to you probably when we fix something to eat later. Maybe green beans might be included with that. Uh, I'm not sure. So we'll just talk to you later, but, uh, this is going to be a relaxation day. We just got back and, uh, do the best, best I can. Okay. She can relax in the middle of freaking tornado. Okay. But Hey, um, I did clutter this room up real quick with my, my bags of, uh, merch. Cause I was, uh, packaging it up later, but when we was gone, um, our friend Melinda had stayed here. Um, I see she did a little decorating in here. She, uh, move some stuff and put it over here and look she cut bob's card there put my card there uh, we got a light candle books uh, we have the shelves up we just didn't finish decorating in here um, she had put some uh, little candies and pencils so if you get bored in a rainy day there's a, a coloring book uh, coloring book there uh, she did write in the book, so we will read that while we eat in there. We're about to go eat and maybe watch TV for a little while. She moved that rose that was in the front room. If you didn't see the Valentine's Day that I did with the uh, Mr. Back and Tasha, check that video out. Um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, uh, 
see about, let me see, April 14th. This was Bob that wrote in this book here. Actually, you know what? I can't read it because she didn't even read. She, she forgot to write in her book. What the heck? Okay, well, Bob's in here twice. Bob came here on February 15th. What I do is, uh, is put the date and the vlog number so if people come to read this and uh, they can see what vlog this was from and they can see what they he left um, Bob had left this the first time with the t-shirt so if you want to check out uh, vlog 271 see for more details check that out um, and uh, let me see try, try to see what she had left here Maybe she left the pencils and stuff like that. Uh, we'll have to, uh, maybe she bought that and left that. Well, she's going to have to fill this out, and then I'll have to put the vlog number on it. So, maybe the vlog will be this vlog, uh, 316. But, I don't know. But we're going to go in the kitchen. She's talking on the phone. Um, but I do have to show you that I did pick up everything. I sent all this to the post office box. Because uh, this is stuff for, uh, mostly all this is for stuff for Ariana's Celebration of Life. Uh, we got like games, um, you know, like bubble stuff, uh, crayons, books, uh, horseshoes, uh, badminton. We got a lot of stuff as well as speakers, Bluetooth speakers. I'm going to use this. Disposal team members sent me this. I'm going to use this for the table up front. Uh, so uh, we got some, um, some turkey cooker deals to keep the meat warm. Uh, we have some signs over there that I got poster boards, tables. Um, we got more stuff coming, so uh, we're doing that July 17th and July 18th. So this video is probably out right about the time that we're doing it or maybe after. So if you missed it, I apologize. But I've been putting it on my social media and on um, my events page on uh www.thegarbsposalstore.com um, I'm about to wrap this up real quick She's uh, she is uh, fixing some food that Melinda, uh, our friend that stayed in the guest room that forgot to sign the guest her. book I know she left her gift but forgot to sign the book Okay, she well, well she's going to come back and sign it and I have to read it but it's not going to be in this vlog It's not unless she comes back like the next couple of days but uh, like we, we was at the uh, High V in the Ozarks in Camdenton um, and we got the whiskey and cola the uh, Crown Royal Washington Apple and the Crown Royal Peach Tea uh, she wasn't going to get this but the but we got all three just because we want to get all three of the new flavors um, and there's somebody in, in, in the line said that was the best so I'm not sure I would think like but I might even want to get get off into it because I'm not drinking it that's for her and her friends to do do that uh, but again, I will. I can eat this, so I'm gonna try this that Jazz, her daughter Jazz, had us sent, and we're gonna try some of the stuff that uh, Randy had gave us. Oh. I'm sending it to Jazz too. Okay, and she's she sending did. this to Jazz, she the Bel Air. Like, she liked it, Jersey. She the Bel Air Jersey and the uh, was that coffee beans? Dark chocolate espresso beans. Dark chocolate espresso beans. So okay, well we're gonna eat. Uh, and oh luna is over here i don't even know if she can move with that thing on she's just sitting perched up at the end of the sorry luna we might have to figure something out if you can't move she can move she didn't get from the back of there to there oh to there to there she waddled to there okay well hey, luna, we're luna. gonna see we're gonna see if she's okay and uh we'll talk to you a bit in a bit go post stop recording all right, the lazy day um, is about halfway, almost over, I guess, because somebody's about to go to sleep. We got a couple hours, right? She's working tonight. Uh, we did watch the Ice Road. Ice, it's called Ice Roads? Yeah, just Ice Roads. I used to watch Ice Road Truckers, and, and Tasha did too back in the days um, on Discovery Channel. Um, not together, because we didn't know each other, duh. But... Um, It was, a, it, was, it was an okay movie. Maybe seven and a half. 7.75. What are you giving it? Seven. She said, guess about a seven. My name's Tasha. Really? Um, 
Well, I opened up all the stuff that I got from uh, most of that Celebration of Life stuff for Ariana Celebration of Life on um, 17th and 18th of July. So I got the games, um, crayons, and coloring books, and and and, and um, games for the kids. So adult games. We got horseshoes, horseshoes, <laughs> and uh, some game. The ladder game thing where you throw the throw that little string with the two balls on the end or whatever. I don't know. I got some um, cornhole games uh, and and some other stuff. I think some other stuff still coming in the mail. Uh, we got my microphone jack so I can get on the mic. Oh, and we're not eating later. We are not eating later because she's going to go to sleep. So... I'm having my dinner right now. Uh, I might watch one more movie um, until she goes to sleep and find me something to do. Maybe edit a video. Nope. Nope. The day ain't over until you go to sleep and wake up. Well, if I didn't get woke up by a phone, I'd probably get an alarm in my face. I know you ain't. I can take a nap. Um... I have edit. I have videos edited. I don't know. I have one for the fourth I need to do for the mukbang. I'm not even sure Lily um, it did a video yet. So it's like, I mean, we tried to do, we tried to do a good cause and um, try to help somebody out to do muk mukbangs, but people don't see it's not as easy as you think to do uh, to do videos. So maybe she's having problems, complications of doing videos uh, or something might have happened on her end, family-wise, or something that, that postponed it all. But uh, I, I try to help other channels out, and a lot of times it falls short. But, hey, long as I do what I do and try, that's, that's, that's all that counts. So. Nothing else to say. Nothing else to say. But I'll just fill you in what's going on next. It's, it's going to be a lazy day, guys, because some people, some people's are not allowing me to be great. <laughs> she wants me to relax. This is really difficult. It's stressful to relax. There's lots to do. I got two lights to put up, two more lights to put up by the chicken coop out there. Solar powered lights. They're going to be out there tomorrow. We got a she shed to do. If it wasn't for me, it would look like a jungle out here. What gets me going under? Is that a song? It's a jungle. <laughs> but it keeps me busy. It keeps me out of trouble. Don't it? What? What are you looking at? I thought I saw something go by the window. No. She's been hearing things. I don't know what she's been smoking. I ain't been smoking nothing. We got in last night. She was hearing stuff, seeing stuff. You heard that last night. It sounded like somebody in the neighborhood got a peacock. Peacock. A oh, peacock. Peacocks like to scream. That's how. I don't know if you ever heard of. My neighbor liked to scream. <laughs> My ex neighbor liked to scream. She wasn't a peacock. What? Right, I gotta go. Go post stop recording. Oh, go post stop recording. Go post stop recording. I'm trying to get this under five minutes. It was under five minutes. And I said, go pro. I said that three times. Oh, time. It didn't even freaking listen. Now I have to. It's extra editing after five minutes of a freaking clip. That's why it was uncomfortable me trying to get off that, right? Just saying it. It was stupid to say it. it so I probably had to get back on here and tell you why I did it. So that's why I did it. Just out the blue, just jump up and try to hurry up and get off, get off here. Because I see the timer saying over five minutes. Well, it was under five minutes. Now it's not because I'm freaking talking still. Go post stop recording. Hey, uh, Tasha's inside sleeping. She thinks I'm gonna be working. I could edit a video, but I told her I wasn't gonna work today. And I'm not, I'm not counting this as work. 
Um, so uh, Luna and I are just uh, walking around the yard. I'm gonna talk to the bigger chickens out here and see how they're doing. Uh, we watched another movie called Fatherhood. Um, really good movies, like chick flicks, no pun intended. Um, I'll give it about an eight, eight and a half. It had Kevin Hart in it. It was a really, really good movie, wasn't it, Luna? It was a good movie. Well, I'm gonna um, stay out here a little while. Probably gonna end this uh, end this vlog right now. Um, it's about to get dark in another hour, but I'll be out here just uh, checking on the chickens and and just talking. Um, usually, I talk over there where the uh, the ladybug um, wind chime is, and we'll go over there later to, to visit Ariana over there. That's uh, that's Ariana's wind. It has ladybugs on it and everything, and and when it dings and stuff, it just gives me something mentally, you know, like hey, you know, she's she's listening or um, she's trying to talk to me or something like that. It just helps out um, in, in certain times. And watch a movie called Fatherhood. It was it was a little rough. Um, I'm not going to tell you what the movie's about, but he has his daughter with him, so it wasn't as hard on me to. Uh, did you just poop on me? Oh, it stinks. Did 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 she? She just pooped on me. Oh. Okay, well I'm gonna try to finish this vlog. Well, um don't don't peck my eyeball out. <laughs> You're the one that pooped on me, so don't get mad at me. Well, uh, and I was saying about um, the movie Fatherhood, I'm not going to tell you the whole uh, story about it, but uh, somebody died, but it wasn't his child, but he raised a child by himself, Fatherhood. Um, and I had moments in there where I saw that stuff that he did with his daughter that I, uh, I remember doing with Ari, and that, that, that was uh, a, little, a little rough, but all in all, uh, it was a good movie. Um, we do have to tell you the we have to rig up the diaper for her in the house because it's, it's not the it, I think she's too small for the diaper right now so we got to figure that out okay well she's getting antsy she's gonna poop on the other shoulder so let me um, tend to the other chickens they're all coming to see what's going on over here hey what are y'all girls doing that one looks like a rooster. That one looks like a rooster. You're getting, oh, oh yeah. Look at that. I don't know, that one too. We gotta see when they get older if they're gonna. Oh man, I gotta take this shirt off. I gotta go guys, I gotta take this shirt off. It's more like poop, poop. Look, right there, right there. God dang it, and it's just nasty. It's a wet one too. I gotta go. Let me take your shirt off. Okay, just want to say thanks for watching the vlog. Um, see you on the next one. I really appreciate it. Please share it with your friends, family, even your boss. Um, there's nothing else to say. I gotta go before I get pooped on again. Let's go, Luna. Go post stop recording. Hey, thanks for watching the video again. If you haven't visit my website yet um the the address is www.doggarbagedisposalstore.com you can navigate through the top all these links right here um there is actually a question and comment form if you have any questions or comments uh, fill that out and it'll go straight to my email at the very bottom there is a free newsletter just sign up for right here um, and you will get a weekly newsletter so uh if you haven't subscribed to the channel, what are you waiting on? Hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, hit see all so you get all the notifications and don't miss the videos. Please comment. I like to um, listen to your comments uh, and respond to you. So I do like to interact with you guys. Uh, please share the video with your friends, family, even your boss. And have a great day. Let's meet other plans.